Hi everyone. Today we will discuss about nonlinear pharmacokinetics. So before going to the nonlinear pharmacokinetics, we should know what is linear pharmacokinetics. So whenever a drug is administered at different doses and plasma concentration time profile is uh, determined, either it may be oral route or parental administration as shown in the picture, at different doses like 10, 20, 30, which is indicated as D, 2D, 3D, you will get different concentration time profiles. But once you do the dose normalization, that is whatever the concentration obtained with the particular dose divided by the initial dose or starting dose, that is called as dose normalization. Then in such case, all the three concentration time profiles should superimpose. Then we can say that particular drug is following linear pharmacokinetics. That may be in any route as shown in the picture. So what exactly happens in linear pharmacokinetics? So in linear pharmacokinetics, there exists a linear relationship between plasma concentration dose or AUC area under the curve and dose as shown in this picture. So it is clearly indicated that as the dose is increasing, the concentration as well as AUC are increasing at a proportionate rate. These are called as linear pharmacokinetics or there is a linear relationship between these things but if any deviation happens in this relationship as shown in the picture so if you observe closely the concentration and dose suddenly increased there is no relationship between similarly in AUC and dose also there is a sudden raise in the AUC after particular dose so these kind of deviations occurs due to non-linear pharmacokinetics. So how to determine? First, you administer drug at different doses, determine the plasma concentration versus time profile, then do the dose normalization. If the graphs are superimposable, it is linear. If the drugs, are, the cows are not superimposable, then it is called as non-linear pharmacokinetics. This is called as principle of superposition, which is used to determine whether a drug is following linear kinetics or non-linear kinetics.